Okay, and then I'm going to follow that up with uh, better explosives redo, better locational damage, um, all the better locational damage for the expansions. I like to use the ghoul edition because um, I like it when the ghouls go down only with kind of headshots. Now the leveled lists for better locational damage has to be here for the DLC. That's that's critical that that, fo that that it follows this exact order, and I'll show you why later. Because that's what what I'm going to be doing today is I'm going to be basically creating patches here at the end to make sure that um, whatever comes last in the load order list doesn't overwrite everything else when it comes to the level my enemy leveled lists. I want my enemy leveled list to be consistent. So. Super Mutant Redo. The Lost uh, Super Mutant uh, Redo Patch. The Armor Smith Extended for that. The VISG Patch for that. Raider Overhaul. Now Better Perks Enhanced. I really like the way that Z did that. There's no reduction in my VAT speed time. That means that shit's like I'm still getting shot at even if I'm in, van at, in VATs. I don't get a um, second in time for a break. Better cooking and better chems give me more recipes. No combat music. Then comes the... Um, the um, basically stuff that uh, is for that adds to characters and non-player characters and appearance-based stuff. So these you have to load manually and rename them. I'll show you how to do that if you've got a, a big question about it. Um, same thing with more beards, chaos hairdos. It actually takes you away from Nexus mods. So you can down. You have to download those things. Um, eyes of beauty, more facial hair, lots more male hairstyles, merged appearance, companion overhaul. Okay, basically, um, this is this really is just going to give me um, the best cape. Cedo. Desdemona, Kasumi, Mason, Magnolia, Maxon, Max Black, Nasty Nisha, uh, New Face, I like them clean. Then we get into the um, accelerators. So your FPS fix, all in one, Paladin Bailey Red uh, Rocket, that's both of them are crucial. There's another one that, that's um, a pre combine that's been re released that's supposed to cover it all. I tried it. Um, and it might work, it might not. I just stick with what I know. Eventually, these will have to go to, to the bottom of my load order list. Then we get into um, things that are going to uh, basically affect my... basically affect the way that um, the game is played as far as my animations and stuff. Stay focused, sun, automatically lowered weapons. So these are my lowered weapons. My settlement uh, menu manager, because I'm already on to settlements and quests. Okay, lost uh, settlement menu, uh, menu manager patch is going to give me tags. Workshop rearrange, make sure we've got all the bug fixes. Merge visuals, which has uh, got a pretty extensive amount of material in it. Again, refer to buy rate backs, load order guide. Now, uh, this is the patch for um, 
better locational damage that fits with um, HBT. I forget what that is. That might be... Um, it looks like it's part of the uh, merged visual set. I don't recall right now. Wet that gives me all my textures for water. I like clear. A pip boy flashlight, which um, instead of instead of doing the broad beam, it's going to do a specific beam. If I was going to reload it, like if I wanted to change how that's going to function, and I've got my mod organizer um, broken into different categories, I've created new categories just to for the sake of simplicity. Like, um, that would probably be in uh, optics, scopes, and radicals. So there's my um, flashlight. Okay. So I'll break my stuff down into um, animation, armors, sound effects, voice. Everything that's um, by rate back, all the bug fixes, clothing, backpacks, companions, crafting, whether or not I want to add workshop to it, my environment, basically things that are going to change the way the game looks, factions. Gameplay effects and changes, you can see here. Hair, face, and body. My immersion. Locations, my new locations, which I probably won't add in until later, until we get a good, good beta running. Okay. Miscellaneous, these are like uh, patches and shorting ta uh, sorting tags. Um, Modders, resources, and tutorials. Since this is so kind of critical, crucial, I just put it here in its own little area. Or it could be that I wanted to save an older version. So let's check and see if there's a newer version right now. So what I do is I just um, copy that into a notepad. So I can just uh, highlight it and um, pop over to the Nexus Mods and do a quick search. And January was the last time it was updated, so I should have one just fine. I did it in February. So, okay. Raider overhaul. This is specific that you have this um, version 11.4c. Again, if you read by Ratebeck's load order guide, it's going to lead you through a lot of this. Now, my optics, uh, scopes, and reticles, we're going to skip that for now. Overhauls. Okay. The looks menu, customization, companion, uh, um, compendium. Super Mutant Redo, I'll put the synth overhauls in. The Raider Gang's extended. Does a lot to add a lot to the Raider stuff. But these are kind of like expansion materials I'm going to worry about a little bit later. I'm just going to make sure we have a working model. May or may not need that at all. Okay, U4AP Hotfix 2.1a. I think this is the um, newer um, performance patch. Let's take a look. Is it written by the same author? It's not, so I'm just going to skip it. Now this this is the accelerator here that's supposed to handle it all in one. Instead of having to use these. 
but these work great, so and I'm not gonna if it's not broke, don't fix it. Okay. I definitely don't want throwing arcs. Take a look at my plugins here. So now that I got throwing arc at the bottom, what I do is I arrange it in categories essentially to keep everything nice and organized. So that's going to come. Um, it should be fine right around my. Uh, The end of my um, better vats, better cooking, better chems. Because it's going to be below better perks enhanced. And so it's going to overwrite whatever arc is there for um, demolitions. Salvage beacons, I'm going to want those. Now, salvage beacons is under equipment, so you see at the bottom here I've got guns. Guns, like um, that old Matrix clip. Uh, we need guns. Lots and lots of guns. So we're going to put this in with um, just above real throwing weapons. And for now, we're going to disable these um, expansion patches. Now you'll notice now I've got my throwing weapons, my explosives, my grenade launcher, my rocket launcher, my patch for the RPG, my my uh, quad. My four barrel rocket launcher. It could be it can be in one, three, or four barrels with that nice clip you've seen in season five. The patch. Now the Reaper projectile patch. The uh, quad accelerator. The quad uh, technotronic. So basically now I've moved on to building. So I put my explosives in, and now I'm putting in kind of like my handguns. And submachine guns. Can't, you know, you'll never catch me without a max 10. MP7. And then the expansions for it, which are just like the expansions that you would see in um, the G36, the uh, SCAR, the um, RU556, the Service Rifle Expansion um, Project. Pause it for a second, I'll be back. 